This is Robert, Habitat for Bats again. I wanted to take a moment and talk to you about the other houses that are out there. Cedar, uh, no screws, no glues, and not being painted, and the materials that so are made out of So the cedar house, Stephen wrong with some of them. They can make a good backyard house, but that's simply not our target market. But what I would like to do is illustrate some of the differences between the materials that we use and how we construct versus materials you may find that are a lot less expensive. Now the problem, we use cedar for a while for internal components to our houses and the problem that we ran into was splitting and warping and you can see in this particular piece of cedar that I have here is that we have a split that is already formed. This would have made an internal component to a house and unfortunately we won't be able to use With that. With cypress we had a similar problem. It's very durable will not rot for a very long time but again in the sunlight or over time we get warping and splitting now, this is a pretty substantial board that we so would cut materials ultimately out of. we abandoned the cypress as well and we went with a composite material for our uh, commercial houses the composite is certified green by the manufacturer and it is also a weatherproof composite material we've had very good luck with that in now, the components that are out of plywood. It's very important that you get exterior grade plywood. That means that the glue that is used to put it together is weatherproof. It's not going to absorb moisture or delaminate over time. We also chose to use what is called ACX or AC exterior plywood. We use half inch for the majority of our houses. We have used three quarter inch. For and some for our particular case, we chose the grooved surface because it gives you a consistent roosting area and every house gives you the same number of cubic inches of roosting area. What AC logs. is, is a grade. There's an A face and a C face and again it's exterior grade. Now the A face, if you go look at some of the uh, construction stores, you'll find what is called CDX and BCX or you may find CDX and BC exposure 1 which is not as uh, durable, it's meant for more of an indoor use. Now you can see that the side for the A on this is very clean, it's sanded, and it's of a high quality. Even the C sides that we find on the materials that we use uh, typically is closer to a B. And it's also flatter and much more stable with fewer voids on the inside. We actually tried using BCX for a little while. Construction-wise, durability, there's nothing wrong with BC exterior versus AC exterior, except due to the lower quality or lower grade, I should say. Um, it tends to And that's more. a little bit about the materials that we use. If you have any questions, just let me know and I'll see what I can do to answer them. I appreciate your time.